My Side of the Mountain by Dean Craighead George. <laughs> Sam. In the book My Side of the Mountain, I am the boy who ran away to the wilderness to live with my falcon, Frightful. I ran to land that my great-grandfather owned. The piece of land was in the Catskill Mountains. I brought a penknife, a ball of cord, an axe, and $40 with me. Over time, I learned things such as which plants and animals are edible that are essential to living in the mountains. Before I ran away, I checked out books on how to survive, to survive in the mountains. That taught me most of the stuff I needed to know. I built a home out of the heart of an old oak tree. Soon I know most of the animals. A few other humans came upon my home, but I only befriended one of them. The man's name was Professor Bando. Bando happened to come upon my home one day. When he saw me, he became fascinated by, with the way I lived. Soon after that, we became friends. He visited me when he could, mostly stopping for dinner, in for dinner. The other people who found out about me reported terrible things about me to the New York newspaper. This is how my dad found me. You see, in the beginning, I told him that I would run away. He just laughed. Well, after a few months, he brought the whole family, all eight of my siblings and mom too. They built a house out there because mom wouldn't let me live alone until I was 18 and was able to take better care of myself. Obviously, I was disappointed, but that's the way it went.